All right, Coach, uh, kind of a crazy first half, and you rarely see two PKs in a game, much less a half, but it just, correct me if I'm wrong, it just looked like, you know, Ohio State put, applied early pressure, got that goal just less than three minutes in, and it's just kind of kind of had you on your heels and hard to recover from that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think we came out of the locker room on our heels, unfortunately. I'm not sure why. Um, it's uh, disappointing in that, the mentality coming into this one. Um, it looked like, you know, you, like I said, that was about three minutes in, they went up 1-0, and then it looked like maybe you had weathered the storm, and then the second PK was awarded with 14 or 15 minutes left in the half. You just talk about, did, you know, the, the momentum, maybe did you feel there was a brief a moment there or a few moments where BG was kind of back, had maybe weathered that storm, or... Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, we probably weathered it, but we still, we, we weren't on our front, but we were still... Uh still kind of taking shots and taking taking punches we really didn't catch our rhythm until until our guy was sent off and then later in that first half we started connecting a little bit and then um, you know at times in the second half we played a little bit more of our brand but by then you know they're Ohio State's a little bit disinterested in the game and we're playing down a man um, down several goals it's a different story um, you know was there was there anything you can pinpoint as to just I mean I know you know, obviously you never want to concede a goal that early, but was it, I know they're a good team, was it anything they were doing? Was it just a matter of BG being a little flat? Maybe a combination? Yeah, I don't want to take anything away from Ohio State. Uh, very good team, played a great schedule. Um, got some good athletes, some good players, good coaches, uh, but th this was all BG. We just didn't, uh, we didn't come to play. Um, uh, for whatever reason, we, we weren't up to the challenge. And if you're gonna come here and try to get a result, you're gonna have to be good. You're gonna have Gonna have to be close to great, um, and we weren't. Uh, one thing I did want to ask you about, you know, Nick Landsberger comes in cold after that red card, hasn't played in pro close to a month in the game situation, and goes right in and is facing a PK. And he's, I know they scored on the rebound, but I mean, he makes a nice diving save of a PK. Can you just talk about Nick's play and just that that mentality or that you know coming off the bench like that? Well, um, first of all, great save. And the fact that they followed up and finished it doesn't surprise me at all with the way the game was going. They, we were second to everything, including that PK. Right. So our keeper comes in, he makes a heroic save for us, gives us a chance, um, but we're on our heels again and they get it. So uh, that kind of typifies what, what was going on out there, I think, all over the field. But um, the fact that Nick came in and made the save doesn't surprise us. He's a good, good goalkeeper. He was a starter for a long time. He's got a lot of shutouts, a lot of saves. Um, he can, he can certainly manage the game, make some saves, and um, he can win games. And then last thing, kind of a quick turnaround here, but you uh, return to conference play this weekend, Saturday afternoon at West Virginia. Just can you talk about you know, kind of what, what you look to do between now and Saturday? Yeah, we got to figure out why we were off. Uh, I, I will say that I was pleased with um, – the guts and the effort that we showed in the second half. The guts and the effort and even some of the soccer finally showed up in the second half. Uh, but at this point in the season with some of the opponents we have coming up, we, you can't wait a half. You can't even wait 10 right, minutes. Right. So uh, we got to figure out how to, um, how, how to get that from the opening whistle. Okay, sir. Thank you very much. Thanks.